This is my dilemma I have going on in my head right now, and you have it coming up on Wednesday, the mask thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's talk about it. Okay. So now, in in the South, nobody has been wearing a mask anyway, so it's, it's neither here nor there. Right. Not uh, a problem for everybody else except for you who's been wearing a mask. Who's been wearing a mask. So mm-hmm. I've been wearing a mask everywhere I go just because, A... I like to hide from cameras. B, I like to cover this up because you you make fun of this. So, oh, your be- your, your non beard beard, yeah. Yeah, so I cover this up with a mask. But the the problem is now. So I went to a couple of places over the past couple of days, and you walk in with a mask, and immediately I know they're thinking he doesn't have his COVID shots. Right. Let them think that then. I mean, listen, if you're comfortable wearing a mask, if you'd rather have a mask indoors, then let people think you didn't get your vaccine yet. I wear a mask outdoors. I wear a mask everywhere I go. Outdoors? Yeah. Oh, now I have you thinking I'm I'm insane too. Well, outdoors, you don't have to wear a mask. I mean, what I do is, so the, we still have the mask laws here in New York City. You have to wear a mask when you're indoors, but not outside. So what I do is in the building where I live, they ex- actually just sent an email this morning that said, New York state mm-hmm. says we s- still have to wear masks indoors. I know the CDC says in certain states you don't, in certain places you don't, but here in New York state, we still have to wear a mask indoors, which means when you walk around the building, common areas, you got to have a mask on. What I do is as soon as I walk out the door, I rip it off and I put it on my wrist and I walk around outdoors outside without a mask because nobody's gotten COVID from out outdoors. First of all, unless, unless you're in a crowd of people and somebody is sneezing on you or coughing in your face, which it's, it doesn't happen. I don't, I don't walk around in crowds. I'm just taking the dogs out. You know what I mean? So I do not wear a mask outdoors anymore. And then I just keep it on my wrist and throw it back on my face when I go inside the building. But yeah, I don't wear a mask outdoors. That's ridiculous. What? See, you and know, you're I'm, I'm vaccinated. Super I'm wack. You're super wacky to, to wear you know, up until recently, you took an hour to bring your, your food in because it had to go under ultraviolet lights and, and go down to a cave or whatever and get cleaned before you bring it in your house. That I still do. That you still do, but you don't wear a mask when you walk outside. Because you can't get COVID outside. And, and even if, even if I some, somehow come across somebody that is infected, I'm vaccinated. I know it's still it's going through my head. I still want to wear one because I, I just don't want to breathe the same air as Joe Public. I just don't want to do it. I've enjoyed it over the past year and a half. What I've been doing is I have my mask. Sometimes I pull it down around my neck because I've noticed is people that I'll walk by and they all have masks on. And just out of respect for them, I'll put mine up because I'm like, maybe they're immunocompromised you know, maybe one of them is sick, you know, I don't want to take a risk. So I will put my mask up if I see people walking towards me. But it's weird because here in New York City, you know, like our friend Lion King Kitty, she she still wears her mask around and she works in a hospital. And I see a lot of doctors because there's a lot of hospitals in my neighborhood. Mm -hmm. All the doctors and nurses are still wearing masks outdoors. I'm like, they must know something. (laughs) So normally, if I'm if I'm going to be in a crowd of people, if I'm going to go to a park, you know, I'll keep the mask on until I find somewhere to sit and I'll sit away from people and take it off. Okay. Now starting Wednesday, New York, you don't have to wear a mask anywhere. Right. So what are you going to do? Um, I don't go anywhere, but I'll still wear a mask indoors. When you go yeah. food shopping, are you going to keep a mask on? Yeah. 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 For, for grocery shopping, I will. Oh, okay. Yeah, indoors, I will still keep one on because there's a lot of people in my neighborhood that have not been vaccinated, and I know that for a fact. Well, it's only 58% of Americans have, so everybody's going to tell you they have. One out of two people haven't. Well, uh, 56% of New York people in New York City have been vaccinated, 56%, but in my area, there's a lot less. That's still 25 million people <laughs> in New York. I mean, that's that's still a lot of people haven't been vaccinated. Right. That's right. That's what I'm saying, which is why I wear a mask when I'm indoors, you know, regardless and outdoors in crowds. So outdoors in crowds, I'll wear a mask and then indoors. I'm going to continue to wear one until there's no more COVID, you know. Also, I want to wear a mask anyway because I just want people breathing on me. I'm I'm like I've become a little bit of a germaphobe. So, yeah. And that's the thing is when do I stop? 
I bought some really nice masks. I right. like them. Yeah. Do you throw them away? What do you do? I mean, I don't know. Save I'm them so for the confused. next pandemic. <laughs> right. I mean, I'm so confused what to do now. Yeah, it's tough. We, we had dinner with some friends. So because nobody's wearing masks and everyone's vaccinated and the CDC was like, go outside without a mask. Woohoo. I took advantage of it. And I met some friends in the park on Saturday and nobody had a mask on. And then we had dinner with some friends. And not only do we have dinner with friends and sit there without masks on at the table, but they wanted hugs. Uh. I know. Apparently, if you're vaccinated and they're vaccinated, everybody can hug each other. So we didn't do the face to face hug and kiss. We just did the shoulder to shoulder. Like we still kept our heads away, <laughs> but mm. you know, it was still like, yeah, I mean, you know, I, so I hugged my friends this weekend. I saw a lot of friends this weekend and didn't wear a mask around them. Really? That's the first time I've done. Like I've only been without a mask in our little pod, which is my boyfriend and my parents. That's, that's it. It's been the four of us the entire 14 months. So it was weird being like, with other people who are not in our pod, but we were outdoors. So I felt safe. But we don't know how long the vaccine lasts either. Uh, yeah, we do. I mean, six months to a year, depending on which vaccine. We, I've heard different studies. I heard a year. I heard six months. I'm still, I'm still in the good zone. Mm -hmm. So we start worrying in six months. Yeah, but, but we'll get boosters. I want listen, a booster if, now. <laughs> you don't need one now. You're, you're vaccinated now. But uh, that's what it's gonna, Listen, it's going to be a while before this is completely gone because there's too many idiots out there that are still not getting vaccinated and still have COVID. People are still getting COVID. Mm -hmm. You know, some people it's interesting. And, and the, you know, there's all the breakthrough COVID people. I went to see I you know, went to see my stomach doctor last week. Right. And um, I was talking to him about that. I was like, you know, you're vaccinated. I'm vaccinated. But here we are with masks on. He goes, yeah, that doesn't mean anything. He said he said patients of his have had the what they're calling the breakthrough right. where they're vaccinated. He said he had a patient in there just the other day who was like feverish, not feeling well. She's like, I don't know what's wrong with me. She's like, I've been vaccinated, so it can't be COVID. He's like, it could be COVID. And then she was tested and it was COVID. Yeah, because Bill Maher has had his shots. He's got COVID. Yeah, he tested. Po well, no, he tested positive. So he's asymptomatic, which is listen, if we all get tested on a regular basis, the COVID numbers will go up again because people probably are asymptomatic. Don't like none of this. I know. And listen, we're, we're not out of the 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 woods yet. Um, Lion King Kitty, who lives in New York City, she said, you have not seen our lovely New York neighbors spitting on the sidewalk. That's a good point. Mm hmm. Right. And uh, David said he's just starting some cosmetic dentistry. So he's riding this mask thing for a long <laughs> See, time. That's yeah. the perfect time to do it is when you can wear a mask. Right, you can that's hide true. the grill. You can hide yeah. the really the, the beard. You can hide that if you want to. While you're growing the beard in, you can wear a mask. Why don't you put a mask on now so we don't go look at your <laughs> stupid beard? <laughs> I'll put a mask on. You go put a hat on. <laughs> <laughs> that, sounds, that sounds fair. <laughs>